Okay. Will you talk to me? Oh, it's okay. I can, I can yell. I'll be loud. You can yell? <laughs> okay, here. I'll just get closer. <laughs> We're trying to win a brisket and here. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm gonna tell him. Okay, We're trying to so win your brisket. Is that brisket really good? Is that? <laughs> is no, there no, we didn't have oh, none. you haven't had. Did he have some today? No, I, I didn't have any brisket have today. Any. Okay, we gotta win that brisket. Okay, we're ready. Hello, you guys. What is y'all's name? My name is Alice. This is Manuel. And, and how do y'all know Thomas? Um, we know Thomas through our sister Susie, and he also sold us our house in 2015. 2015, and how's that house? Y'all like it? We love it. It's I absolutely it. fabulous. Okay, so tell Thomas some final words, and we are good to go. Uh, Thomas, we love you and Kristen. Thank you for always uh, inviting us to the Friendsgiving, and um, thank you, and we want that brisket. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Any words from you? No, just thank you, Thomas. I love it. Awesome. That was perfect. Sure. Okay, so what is your name? My name is Susie. Susie, and how do you know Thomas? Oh, I worked with Thomas at Trillionaire Assets about 13 years ago. Oh, wow. And how are you still connected into his life? Oh, my gosh. We're both in the mortgage company okay. business, okay. and uh, we've remained friends since then, and he's been an awesome friend. Oh, I love that. How has he, he been an awesome friend? Tell me one or two things. Oh, my gosh. He's so giving, uh, so friendly, so easy to get along with. Um, absolutely love him as a brother. Uh, and Kristen and his whole family and they're just so giving and what an awesome way to celebrate them today Yeah, I love that so much and um, tell me one final thing tell Thomas one final thing Thomas I love you brother we will always be friends forever and always cheers to you brother I love that, that was so she's lovely. videoing you us I, I hold this like this Brandy Persley and Josh Persley. He's a good friend of ours. Um, we've known him for years. Our our kids are friends. Uh, he's our realtor. I he's coach, our they're our friends. I coached Landon when he was little bitty in in football. I was his I was his KFL football coach. Yes. For a bit, so we met each other, and he's become our realtor, our best friend. He's awesome. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so I'm a real estate photographer. Are you? Real estate okay. stuff. Okay. Yes. Yes. Both. Everything. Actually, yes. He's <laughs> he helped us with everything. Home, he's so fantastic. All, he got us a great deal. He's helped us rent. He's helped us buy. He's helped us everything. Uh, we sold our house within days. Yeah. How was that for you guys? Amazing. Amazing. Yeah. Oh, it wasn't like super stressful until like... No. Not with Thomas. Not, Not with, with Thomas. Thomas. <laughs> we great. actually bought our very first house with somebody else and regretted it ever since. We will never buy our house with anybody else except without for Thomas. Him. Never. <laughs> He's amazing. Absolutely. Yes. Oh, uh, we yes. always do. Always. Yeah. Do. We always do. <laughs> Oh, we always recommend, we always Thomas, recommend to Thomas, Thomas to our friends. anybody ever, 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 anybody. ever. Anybody. Yes. <laughs> okay, awesome. So what's your name? Uh, Chris Ellis. And how do you know Thomas? I am married to his cousin. <gasps> no way. Yeah, yeah. So you know all the good I, I, I know everything there is to know. Tell me some secrets. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, he's a genuine person, and he's going to tell you what's on his mind. Yeah. So. For the good or for the bad? Uh, for both. <laughs> <laughs> That's too funny. Okay, so tell me something quirky about Thomas that, I mean, I see a lot of things about. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so we float the river every year, and you wouldn't know, but he's really good doing backflips off of rope swings. No way. Even at, you know, maybe almost 50. Yeah. So he's like a. He, he still likes to, you know, still like a, a child at heart sometimes. Oh, I love that. That's so. awesome. Well, thank you so much for these few minutes. I'm going to tell him you, he better enter you into that raffle. Yeah, he sure better. Yeah. I better win.
Okay. Okay. All set. All set. Ready. So I am Nick Vollert. Hello, Nick. And how do you know Thomas? So I know him through my wife, uh, what was my girlfriend when we met, when we met Thomas for the first time. Uh, He's helped her and her parents uh, buy and sell homes. He also helped me sell my home that I sold when we got engaged because we had two homes and only needed one. And then he since helped us sell that house as we bought another one. So several, several interactions with him. So why did you choose Thomas for so many interactions? Was he really that good? Was he really helpful? So, so I'm, I'm, in, I'm in business as well. I'm in sales. And one thing I really look for with people when you're working with somebody, especially in a large transaction like a home or a car, is you want somebody that's honest, that's got a lot of integrity, that really follows through with what they say they're going to do for you. And he's always done that for us. And that really, that, I hold that to a high standard. There's, there's always going to be snags where nothing ever works smoothly as perfectly as you'd like it to. None of that was ever any fault of his, and he was always helpful to guide us through that process when there was a bump in the road or, hey, this didn't happen on the time frame that we thought, but don't worry, I've seen it before. This is what we're going to do, and there's always an answer, and there's always a solution, and it, it works out. <laughs> He's super knowledgeable, right? Absolutely. Yeah, we'll call him with one-off random questions, and he'll say, hey, there's no dumb questions. Ask me. I've seen it all before, and we'll, we'll figure it out. I love that. Give me some last few words towards Thomas. What do you I just, I just like really just uh, knowing him as a person. I know that he's a, he's a Christian. Again, he's got a big heart. He's really a salt of the earth person as a friend and as somebody you would want to do business with. And I was somebody I would always speak very highly of. I love that. Thank you so much. Thank you. You're entering into that raffle. All right. Hi, I'm Andrew Villarreal, otherwise known as Tugboat. And I know Thomas because he actually sold us our house in Huffman that we live in now that I actually grew up in. And he was just telling us a story about how he looked and embedded into his brain that my parents wanted me to go to Huffman ISD. So he just told me the story about all that, which I never knew until about 10 minutes ago. But I thought that was pretty funny how he still remembers it. And that's the house that I grew up in. That's the house that I learned to rope in, raise animals and all that cool stuff. And that's actually where I got this buckle from, is right there in Huffman. And then that is how we know Thomas. Sold us an amazing house, a couple acres over there, and we kept adding on. Now he became one of our close friends because of that. So we invite him over for parties and stuff like that. And then they invited us here, so that's why I'm here. And, and then, so how's your, how's your experience just working with him? How, what, what kind of person is Thomas? Thomas is a very loving and affectionate person. Even though he keeps business aside, he also still has a heart for everybody. So it's very understandable of why he has such a good succession or success with realtoring and all of that. Awesome. So would you recommend Thomas to anyone that you know looking for a home or looking to sell a home? Absolutely. Just because he doesn't just want to sell you a home and make money, he wants you to be happy and find a place for you, which is the best thing ever. Thank you, Thomas, and hope you had fun tonight, and thank you for the invitation. So I hear you, so just whenever you talk, just bring it up close. Okay. All righty, how do you know Thomas? Hey, Thomas, we're your neighbors. (laughs) We're on Golden Pond, and you always run the uh, sleigh ride at Christmas, and we live on Golden Pond and bring um, candy canes out to all your passengers. So that's how we know you. Is he a good neighbor? He's a good neighbor. He's very spirited. At Halloween, we've got a ship in his yard, a pirate ship. No way. Yeah, and so he always brings good life to the community. That is awesome. And um, is that cheerful for the kids? Do the parents like bringing their kids over? or, or how is It's that parents, it's children, it's grandparents. Mm-hmm. So he brings life to the party. Yeah, and how do y'all feel about that, being his neighbor? Is that too loud and crazy? Do you want to yeah, we'll take it. No, we absolutely love it. We and we so appreciate him too. Yeah. You know, for doing all of that. Yeah. Yeah. He has an old tractor and pulls a hay ride, oh and we we stay in our yard because we run out and stop the, yeah. the train to, to pass out candy canes. So yeah, we really love it. Oh, it's love outstanding. That. How many years have y'all been neighbors? We've been here since two thousand. Oh wow! So, He's the newbie. He's the newbie. He's yeah. the newbie. Yeah. Yeah. He's wow. the newbie. <laughs> and so how did y'all feel about him coming into the neighborhood with all his spirits? 
<laughs> well, we've lived here, we've moved to Kingwood three times, so we need somebody that's got the spirit to keep it alive here. Oh, well, good for Thomas. That was great yeah. to be here, and thank you guys for your time. Thanks, Y'all Thomas. Y'all will be entered into a raffle to win some prizes. He said some brisket. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> we enjoyed that brisket. Yay! <laughs> All righty, thank you all folks. All righty, what's your name? Maria. And how do you know Thomas? Through his wife. Through his wife? Okay, tell me yes. a little bit about how your uh, rela relationship with his wife and Thomas have been. I've known her since she was 16 years old. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Well, because I worked with her dad, okay. and at the time she was selling vacuum cleaners, so she came to the house and told us a vacuum cleaner. Oh my yeah, yeah, I've known her dad for over 29 years, so I've known the family. They're awesome, amazing. They're family to us. Oh, that's beautiful. I love it. Yeah. And you live nearby? I live in Atascocita. In Atascocita. Yeah. Okay. Have they ever helped you with, with any real estate transactions? Uh, actually, when we're going to buy our house, we had another realtor, but he helped me to make sure that I was being treated right, and you know, he he helped us out a lot. Yay, that's amazing. Yes. Are there some final words, some words that you want to tell Thomas his wife? Oh, I love you guys, and I'm glad I'm part of your family. I'm Randy Velvin. And Ursula Velvin. And how do you know Thomas? Well, let's see, back in the late 80s, me and Thomas met when we worked at Domino's Pizza together. Yeah. No way, I heard about that Domino's yes. Pizza yes. store. Yes. Yeah. And how was that experience? Oh, wow. <laughs> Some crazy times back I then. I plead the fifth. <laughs> I don't want to incriminate anybody. <laughs> Because yeah, this is a, on video. It was, it was young times. Young yeah, times. we had yeah. fun. Yeah. Well, <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta go. <laughs> were you doing delivery or actually? Yeah, we were both doing, doing delivery at the yeah. time. Yeah. Yeah. So. yeah, we would pitch in and, you know, help uh, on the other stuff all the way around, dishes and everything. But, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's where I met Thomas. And, yeah. you know, so we've... Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. And, you know, we, we, we had... You know, we, we've kept in touch. He helped us buy the house that we have now. We've been living in for how many? 15 years. Almost 15, 15 years. years. He helped us buy that house. Wow, so yeah. 15 years ago, he helped you guys. Mm -hmm. yep. And y'all still stay connected? Yeah. Yeah. Wow, just through friendship, mm -hmm. through these crazy yeah. parties that he had. Yeah, mm -hmm. he's got the bulldog. We got bulldogs, yeah, we so bulldogs it's kind of a thing. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so. <laughs> I love that. Okay, yeah. so if you guys remember from 15 years ago, how was that real estate transaction? Oh, it was great. He did oh, a great yeah. job. Wow. It sounded like drums. Wow. <laughs> no, but he was very professional. He knew yes. his stuff. I remember Kristen was helping him at that. Kristen was helping him at that time. So she would come and, you know, talk to us and give us, like, insight into the loan process and how it was going to go. And they were just very uh, on top of everything. So they really helped us figure. That was our first uh, big home. That was a big first big home purchase. Quick and easy. Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah. So y'all stayed in that same house mm -hmm. for 15 years? Yeah. yeah. So y'all made a good decision? Yes, we love it. We think yeah. so. Wow, that's <laughs> crazy because usually like, people change homes every five to seven years. Exactly. No, yeah. we love yeah. our area and the neighborhood and the house. And it was, Is it here it was in Kingwood? Mm -hmm. yeah. Right over in Kings River. Kings River. Uh, close yeah, just right here. across the bridge. Mm -hmm. Okay, <clears throat> awesome. So give me some final words to Thomas, some loving words. Uh, <laughs> hey, this is to you walking around in Domino's Pizza in your socks, bro. <laughs> He'll know what I'm talking about. We hope to get on and that's and that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> we hope to get on your yacht one day and go for a little ride with our dog. We love you and your family, man. You're the greatest. <laughs> you cannot change. But you cannot change. My name's Haley Vasquez. And how do you know Thomas? I 
know Thomas by my Aunt Susie. I'm her niece, and he's been to a couple of Halloween parties, and he's so much fun, and I love him and his wife. They're amazing, and thank you for inviting us. We're having so much fun. <laughs> Hey, Dakota. <laughs> Let's just sit and be nice for a minute, okay? Okay. Hello. What is y'all? What are y'all's names? Uh, Chris and Kylie Robinson. Awesome. Let me actually put y'all a little bit together. Can I oh, yes. scoot the chairs in? Yeah, that would be perfect. Yay. Okay. What are y'all's names again? Chris and Kylie Robinson. Awesome. And how do y'all know Thomas? So we got referred to him by my sister, who he helped sell a house to, oh, um, helped awesome. them find a house. Yeah and they just really liked him and so we gave him a call and he helped us find a house too wow and how was y'all's process like was it smooth or did y'all come i mean it, i felt like it was smooth but it was our first home and we were buying it from another state so oh my i gosh. would say he probably did a really good job in that case yeah, yeah no way so i imagine for a mom for a wife moving from state to, to another is this brand new to you guys texas mm -hmm. yeah yeah how was that new. It was great. I mean, Thomas made it super, super easy. I wasn't worried at all. I wasn't even super involved with it. I knew that he and you were handling everything, and we just we love it here. And Thomas says uh, he he made sure to like tell us about the community and how amazing it is here, and it's really lived up to everything he said about about Kingwood. So. Yay. And y'all like y'all's house and, and the neighborhood and everything. Oh, we do so Yay. much. I love that so much. Okay, so final words to Thomas. Final words. Final words. <laughs> Ending words. Closing words. Yeah. He he did a great job, and we're happy that he got to help us. And he's a great guy, and it's it's nice to start off so well in the community. He did a really good job of making us want to come here. So nice to finally um, you know put a face to the name and yeah, first and time we've met him since we moved here over a year ago. Yeah. So no way. yeah, oh my God, never met him. Crazy. Yeah. yeah. So um, that's a lot of trust that y'all put on a person. Yeah. 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 Because so. of that referral, or just because talking with him made things, or had y'all researched something about him? Or? No, just he, he did a good job for my sister and her family, so. Okay, yeah. Wow. And he always, I mean, I assume he did a good job. We didn't have any issues, so yeah. I think yeah. I think he did a pretty good job. We were happy ah! and, and talking to him mm. and, and getting to know him, and I mean, it's so nice to come here and see the community he's made and the the impact he's made in 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 the in in the community. So. Yeah. It's, it's great to see. Yay, thank y'all so much for y'all's time. Yes. Thank Are y'all ready to get out of here? Yeah. Thanks.